Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the added little readings that I like to do through the month about um, the animal spirits cards that I love to use, which are the uh, Kim Cran's animal spirit cards. I like to do this little bit of added uh, extra, which is um, it shows me a challenge or things that are unexpected elements that are going to be coming in as well uh, for the month of January. I am now going to be reading for the lovely Cancers. Um, and I have struggled myself. I feel like the energies for most of the signs coming in because we have got the um, the full moon on the 10th of January. And I feel this full moon of Cancer um, is, you know, pulling on everybody's emotions at the minute as well. So the cards I'm going to be using, I'll drop in the description box. If you're new to my channel, um, then I am using the uh, Colette Baron Reed, uh, the Good Tarot. Um, obviously the Kim Cran's Animal Spirit and my trusty Cheryl Richardson self-care cards for these readings that I do. Um, so without further ado, I'm going to start shuffling and get out the uh, Animal Spirit card that is going to be tagging in with you, Cancer, for January for the challenges or unexpected things that are happening. But yeah, I've, I've struggled myself. Um, I just feel that the energies. People are struggling at the start of Jan on all signs. So let's have a look what's going on for you, Cancer. Cancer, Cancer, Cancer. Okay, just put that there a second. I'm just going to shuffle one of these self-care cards. A card, please. That one wants to come out. Peace. Oh, that's nice. We all like a bit of peace. We wish we could have a little bit of peace. Okay. Cancer, Cancer. Another key element, please. Another key player for the challenge for January for Cancer. What have we got coming in? Unexpected. Blindsided. Life likes to throw curved balls at us, doesn't it? Doesn't it just? Life never runs smooth. But it'd be boring if it did, wouldn't it, guys? So let's have a look what we've got here. Right then, Cancer, let's have a look what's coming in with you. We have oh, the alchemical sign of air, and it's the moth uh, animal spirit card. We have the peace. Embrace your confusion. Let there be peace in not knowing all the answers. We have the elephant, the alchemical sign of fire. Okay, just read for somebody who had the elephant in there. And we have the justice card. Right, okay. So, let's have a look what we've got going on here for you, Cancer. The moth um, animal spirit is coming in then because it's saying here, there's a situation going to be coming in unexpected in January where there's something troubling you cancer there's something troubling you something on your mind consuming your mind and you're feeling quite fragile as well at the moment as we go this is all the signs I'm just feeling this vulnerability and I don't know whether it's to do with the full moon that's coming in on the 10th of January as well but it's saying here, your challenge uh, for January is saying stop overthinking things, okay? Stop overthinking things. Um, yes, you might not have all the answers at the moment of where you are being directed. The situation um, that is coming in around you is coming in with this elephant uh, energy, okay? Something is literally going to be, I want to say railroad in itself into you. It's going to come out of the blue really, but it's going to come with some magnitude, okay? And it's as though some of you have been waiting for an outcome on something and this is where the overthinking has been going on. The challenge for you is to say, don't preempt things because I do feel that the outcome of this because it's like justice 
it's like some of you here are waiting for justice um having the moth spirit here is your is your energy you know uh very vulnerable uh attracted uh to the light but it's the light in this circumstance not to confuse you or cancer is the message that is coming through is saying don't don't try and speculate the outcome of a situation that you are waiting for i feel some of you out there are waiting for some legalities to come through as a resolve it could be to do with um you know uh things that are going through court uh for access around children uh family matters okay but the key element for your challenge is not to be in this situation not to be feeling um drawn i just want to say drawn here it's like some of you will be keep wanting to pick up the phone keep wanting to send messages trying to get the answers that you're desperately waiting to hear trying to push something quicker than what's you know the information's coming through to you but it's just saying sit tight this is your challenge okay cancer it's saying you've just got to sit it out okay don't be keep being drawn you know don't be keep adding to the fuel to the fire now i want to say to some of you because by just sitting and doing nothing now because the groundwork's already been done okay the groundwork's already been done here this is why the moth spirit is coming in um just to say stay where you are because if you see if you see moths around okay they'll get to a certain point and they will not move for absolutely ages okay that they, they, yeah they get drawn to lights and you see them flicking around the lights but i just feel here this is the moth where it's literally landed and has, and has stayed in that one place okay literally stayed in that one place and this is the energy that i'm feeling with you cancer you are you have literally just got to sit and wait okay because this elephant um spirit card is bringing the resolve okay the justice that you want and it's going to be uh, the jewel in the crown the jewel in the crown here and the golden opportunity at the bottom here this is the resolve this is your golden ticket this is your golden payout this is your golden piece of paper okay that you've been waiting for um where you have got the justice coming through as i said it's not going to resonate with everybody but i'm just picking up with some cancers here who have literally been you know um, being this moth literally you know going at it trying to get the answers you know what's happening what's going on why am i still waiting okay that energy okay that you've been through but now we're in the situation where the moth has landed okay you've got to be the moth that's landed and just in one place okay and wait because you will get the resolve you need so the challenge for you cancer for january is you haven't got to have all the answers you've done enough the groundwork's in the paperwork whatever has all been presented it's just saying this is you just wait because if you can just see the full moon just about to surface behind okay it's going to come to a completion you are going to get the justice and you are going to get the jewel in the crown and get the resolve you need so it's not going to resonate with everybody as i said they're just a little bit of added um message i like to put in through the month um for challenges etc so cancer that is your message um for january so i hope you can take something away from that and i'll look forward to reading to you next time take care my lovelies bye